Let me just set this monster down. It's going to be hard to get this all in frame as it's the same size as my desk and god knows why it's so heavy. Now on the sides of the box here, just underneath the cover, there's some really lovely models. Let me just take some pictures so you can guys can see. Now from the looks of things I was lucky enough to get the pre-order coin and the markers even though technically I didn't pre-order it but the guys at my games workshop were good enough to give me one. This coin, which I think I'm going to call a mega coin because I can, and oops, let me try that again. There we go. Looks like doing the space moves for the first video. Now this looks like some kind of magazine, maybe a catalogue, uh, but on closer inspection it does appear to be a miniaturised codex. Now this is the book I've been looking for, the instructions. Now this instruction booklet is really nice, after some of the older models I've been working on it's nice to have a full hands-on, full colour labelled booklet that I can refer back to instead of making educated guesses on what the model is. These models do look amazing. I've never properly played or painted either Space Marines or Necrons, so this will be interesting. Again, looking inside this, these models do look fantastic. I can really only hope that one day I'll get to this level. It would appear that a lot of dead dinosaurs went into these sprues, and but they're not really that heavy, so there must be something else in the box. Like in this artwork, not really sure what's going on with this dude's mouth though. I'm guessing that the Necrons are too snooty for transfers because this is all Space Marine stuff. I 
Ah, uh, here we go. This is why the box is so heavy. It's the core book. Not going to be playing, but the artwork in this book is stunning and the models are simply amazing. Again, I can only hope that I can get this kind of level one day. Last but not least, let me just get these two out of the way and we'll see what's hiding in the depths. Nothing too fancy, but it looks like it's just some bases. Now, I did take a quick sneak at the instructions, it does say that you need to use the correct bases, so I guess I'll be using the correct bases. Now I am definitely looking forward to making a start on this. This is probably the first box that I bought in about 5-6 years, something like that. At the time of writing and recording I do only have one video out, but I think I'm going to switch to a 3 video format. That being building, then painting up to a battle ready state, and then finally adding some details in the last video. And ultimately the plan for this box is to have every single unit to be from a, either a different chapter for the Space Marines or a different dynasty for the Necrons. That way I can show you guys how to paint multiple different types of armies at the same time. On the back of that, if you do have any special requests of what you'd like to see painted, let me know down in the comments. Until next time, happy painting.